I literally watched a video the other day of a girl who had a shirt very similar to this and she she didn't zip it up like she just turned around and she was like so this is the top and I couldn't get it zipped up on my own so I'm just going to show you what it looks like like this and I'm watching the video like sis why don't you just zip the thing up and then here I am 10 minutes later trying to zip this up on my own and I just want to submit a formal apology to that girl on my behalf of my thoughts because this is so freaking hard. How am I supposed to get dressed on my own? It's in there. Now, what's the real? Oh my God, I need my mom. Ma? My mom helped me. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. Brianni here. Today I have a haul for you from House of CB. If you're looking for some super cute things to add to your wardrobe for spring slash summer of this year or forever, then stay tuned and let's get it. Dahlia top in an extra small. I'm going to show you what the small looks like, but I personally like the fit of the extra small. It's supposed to be corset like, and the small just wasn't pulling me in. It was still comfortable. This top is still comfortable, but this really feels more corset like. Like, I feel like I'm lifted. It's sucking me in in all of the right places. So the back does have a little bit of stretch factor just to make you a little bit more comfortable, but it doesn't take away from the motion that it does. As you can see, I have three items, including this one with the same print, so y'all just gonna have to get used to this. I also have a very dang near non-existent chest. My bra size is 34 to 36B. And my waist is a, I think it's a 26 and a half to 27. I could be lying. I could be 27 and a half because, you know, when I do measure myself, I like bring it in and then I pretend I'm smaller. Body positivity here. No body shaming. I'm just saying I have bad habits. Sue me. If they go off camera for this one, you have to subscribe to my OnlyFans if you want to see more. <laughs> I'm also just kidding, mom, I do not have an OnlyFans. I, I am gonna take that L and just be broke. Quick side note, I just realized if you're having trouble putting your top on, you can just zip it backwards and then twist that bad boy around like you're putting on a bra. All right, this is the Dahlia top in a size small. You can see the fit difference. It is just a little bit looser. I find that the straps Kind of do this thing here, like a little gaping, which I'm not a huge fan of. It fits pretty much the same everywhere else. I'm fairly certain that the extra room in the small does just come in the stretch factor in the back. And you can dress it down with some sneakers, dress it up with heels. This top is great because you can also wear it when you're going out, dinner date, out with your friends, just going shopping and you want to stunt on everybody. This is the Olivia top in a size small. You can literally just wear them with a pair of jeans. Like there's nothing wrong with this outfit at all. So there's just a little like bra thing in here that supports the girls, helps them sit up. And then this sits really nicely on the outside and gives it a look. And these are very snug to your shoulders. They don't go anywhere, but you are free to move in them. This is the Tia top in white in a size small. Very similar to the Dahlia top that I tried on, just a plain white pattern slash color. The material is a little bit softer on this one, so it's a little easier to move around in it. 
but it is just as cute. It does not fall short on any cuteness or, you know, durability, how it's manufactured. It's literally the same, just different material and a different color. The bra inside is still the same, so it gives great support. I am in love with this top. I'm so happy that I went back and I was able to grab it. And I do think that I got it on sale as well, so. This is a really nice addition to anyone's summer slash spring wardrobe for this year or any years after. I kind of think that this is a really timeless piece. Like you can wear this four or five years from now and it will still be in fashion. So I really like that. Okay, so this dress is the care dress in a size medium. I actually have it here in a size small as well so I can do a size comparison. I'm not sure what it is with this dress in particular, but I did have to size up to a medium. And now that I'm here, I'm not really loving all of the extra material that this dress has in the like stomach area and then also back here in the booty area. I feel like I'm just walking around like this. Like it comes all the way out like this. And then this stuff is happening back here and this is a super cute dress for those in the, you know, little booty. Is there a, is there a thing for that? I know they have itty bitty titty committee. Itty bitty titty committee. Um, I'm a part of that. No shame. And what's like the, do we just call them little booties? It gives you some booty. But I don't want this and this. Like I just wanted, I wanted one or the other. Just this one, really. I think I definitely could have gotten into the small, which is what I usually wear if I, you know, had an eight on a quarantine snatch. But my mom bought them. What? I'm not supposed to do just not eat them. That's rude. So. All of them, and they were good, as you can see. This is just an overall very feminine, fun, sexy dress, something that you can just throw on during, you know, a date night, if you're just going out and you wanna wear something that's really cute. You can definitely pair it with an open toe heel, I think. Something that's not black though, I think this is just too much of a contrast with this dress. But if you find any colors that are in this dress, like a, a nude, a peach color, I think it'll definitely work. I give it a 2.5 for doing this to me. But if this wasn't this, if this wasn't here, if this wasn't a thing, I think this would definitely be a 5 out of 5. Yeah, let me throw on the small so you guys can see the size difference. I usually wear about a 6 to an 8 getting closer to the six side and pants. I haven't figured out my dress size just yet because I have been losing a ton of weight very quickly and then putting it back on because of getting quarantine snacks. But my tops are always small, so... Let's see if I can fit into this thing. Look at my face. Do you see the moisture on my face? I literally broke a sweat trying to put this dress on. I know I was small, like, well, I wasn't small and so I ate all the snacks, but I do like the way this one fits more. Like there's no pouch, like no extra material. I mean, there is a pouch, I have a pouch. I'm a kangaroo. This is my little kangaroo pouch and it's keeping all of my all of my quarantine snacks safe. This is my, my safety pouch right here. If you don't have one, your snack's not safe. This is the fit and figure that I wanted with this dress. I just, <clears throat> I can't breathe. I feel like a, a bad bitch. I feel like a bad bitch when I wear this dress. You can't tell me anything. Can't tell me to pay my rent, can't tell me to move my car, pay that parking ticket. No, I'm not doing it. I'm wearing this dress. Try me another time during my normal business hours when I'm just Brianni. You 
mistakes were made at three o'clock in the morning. But I'm completely fine living with those mistakes because I'm cute. So this is a cute mistake. This is a cute mistake that I made on purpose because I like being cute and looking cute and feeling cute. My bank account was not cute, but I am. So it's okay.